I'm Anil Kumar. I'm a director of product management at Couchbase. I'm responsible for Couchbase server uh, product roadmap, strategy, and development. So the Couchbase autonomous operator, uh, we can think of as a autonomous vehicle, right? It's a um, it's self-service, self-repaired, self-healing kind of uh, operation. So what we have done is a, we have built a native integration with Kubernetes. Right? The goal here is to reduce the operational complexity of deploying, managing the Couchbase cluster on, on Kubernetes. Right? It also enables the uh, customer to run database uh, on any infrastructure on any cloud. So at a high level, the, again, the Kubernetes uh, is a container orchestration platform, right? Uh, but it gives a lot of benefits. Uh, it removes the infrastructure lock-in. Right? It also enables the cloud portability. Right? And um, so with the Couchbase native integration, now our customers can basically, um, we have automated our operational best practices. So uh, provisioning, scaling, managing, upgrade, backup, all of these operations can be autonomous now. So every customer we have come across has this hybrid cloud or multi-cloud strategy. The goal is that they want a flexibility in terms of where they want to deploy and uh, if they want to migrate from one cloud to another cloud. With the Kubernetes platform, uh, they can now be able to like move, move around with multiple clouds. Plus, Couchbase offers a cross data center application which can be used to migrate the data between one cloud to another cloud. So you can get started by um, now going to uh, Couchbase documentation. We have instructions about how to deploy Couchbase on open source Kubernetes, uh, how to uh, get started on the Red Hat OpenShift. Uh, they are one of our partners who has the enterprise Kubernetes offering.